The beauty of fly fishing is its mystery. There are a thousand variables. Selecting the correct combination of feathers and fur to dress a hook is one of them. We naturally gravitate to these favourites. Time and time again we each turn to our trusted ensemble of feathers and fur even when they let us down. One particular evening, the classic debate reared its head. What's the best dry fly ever? We all presented our favourite dry flies and after much toing and froing we were at the crossroads. The only way to truly reach a conclusive verdict was to head back up to the high country and put them to the test the only way we knew how. It's going to be a good day, lads. So we were all carrying on at the pub last night, trying to figure out what our favourite dry fly is. We've got it down to three options. I'll be on the parachute Adams today. Dom's going to be throwing the caddis and uh, Henry's going to be throwing the big hoppers around. We'll see who comes out on top. We can, we can run that um, but yeah, I'll be throwing around a caddis on the butter stick. I think that's a deadly combo, personally. Definitely going to outfish the, uh, the boys in their traditional setups. May as well have 10 cars on them. Mate, I am a purist, um, obviously, so I'm going to be throwing a Parachute Adams pattern today. I'm throwing the, the hopper pattern today, this is my favourite favorite type of fly. But we've struck, a pretty, we've struck a pretty good day, it's going to be, a, it's going to be pretty good conditions, so it's a beautiful day up here, really looking forward to it. but it's a great way to start and it shows they're looking up so anyway don't know where Andrew is but uh, one on the hopper and uh, I think none for the other so <laughs> who knows it's looking good for the hopper Just uh, tucked in right against the right against the bank above the sand. Thanks to Andrew's call out and Henry's guidance. There's uh, one for Team Caddis there, so very excited for the day. Mate, I'd love a trout. I'd love a trout. Would take any species at this stage. It's been a bit slow on the para. Too fast. So after messing up, messing up a couple of takes, a couple of eats, finally managed to secure first flight for the parachute atoms. First fish for the parachute atoms. Oh, that was sick. Oh no. Oh no. Need the net, man. Oh, double. We're on the double. Yeah, get that one, get his head up. Boom. 
Well, boys. Awesome. Alright. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Pulled up for some morning tea, a bit of a coffee stop. Couldn't help ourselves. Dropped another couple of casts in and got the double up. <laughs> so good. So good. Good morning, Yin Yang. Took your time, it was good fish. Yeah, good fish. Cool, should we keep going? Catch some more. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> Sorry, little guy. Come on. This is all about numbers of fish, not necessarily size. Quantity over quantity. Wait. Quantity over quality in this case. I think little fish are still quality though. Sardine! <laughs> no, nothing can resist the caddis. Lifts the fight another day. Alright. I think caddis just takes the lead. What I lack in experience, I make up for with the with the best fly, so we'll just keep that on a roll. I'm gonna have to swap this out for a freshie, I think. Ah, I'm just going to keep just a couple on, on deck because the fish... Oh. <laughs> oh, you put them in here? Yeah, 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 the plastic one. <laughs> Thought you were trying to stitch me up, secure the lead. Lead me astray. Yep. There it is. Another absolute <laughs> monster. Look, I've got some. I've left myself some work to do in the second half. Um, I'm I'm sitting on a couple. Dom sitting on two or three, but he should probably be doing better than that. Um, and uh, Henry's Henry's doing pretty well on the hopper. No, oh. he's on the he's on the side. On the numbers, yeah. numbers. Came up and wailed on the dry. <laughs> no wonder he's after the big fly. He needs a big meal. Look at him. He's tiny. I'll, I'll sneak one in his run. <laughs> in his run. <laughs> you saw that, Henry. Oh, that's hilarious, man. heaps of fun on the grasshopper. Caddis will do that to an innocent brown. Yes. A little parachute. Little parachute. Another cool little brown on the parachute, Adam. Really cool eat. Came up, checked it out, realised it was the real thing and uh, inhaled it. So you wouldn't get that on some other flies. See you later. Yes! Yeah. No. <laughs> Did you see that coming over? Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Hoppers are uh, hoppers closing in on the catapult of it, isn't it?
another double up for the day. Yet another brown for the Adams. That seems to be exclusive. This guy smoked the whole up. Problems I got fixes to solve for my forgot what I said. Smoke machine in my head. Yeah, it's just been just been an awesome day so far. They've been taking taking everything. The colours on this guy is uh, definitely something you get up on on these Alpine streams. Sticks pounder. What do you think of his top on that? I mean, uh, it's fine if that's what you're into. It's absolutely fine. Like, I think all of Henry's fish have actually been stockies, from what from what I can see. Yeah. <laughs> see? That was a wild fish and it was too smart. Too smart. Let's get mean. Yes! There's the net boy. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> Sorry, man. I reckon he's an absolute parking lot in there. Yep. Oh. Coming. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Oh. Watch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Oh, yep, come, yep. Oh, oh, oh my God. Goodness. That was cool. Good work, man. Dude. I am happy with that. So having missed fish, dropped fish, busted fish off, uh, and all around just fished like an absolute muppet today, it's good to finally manage to stick a pretty reasonable brown for a small creek like this. Just sauntered over, checked out the atoms, and sipped it from the surface. All, uh, all three of us here, me fishing and two on the bank watching, um, great, to, uh, great to get a fish. Sensational day, but I think we're getting rained out here, and, and we, uh, everyone's best interest to call it a day. In the end, we were spent. Wrecked from a huge day fishing, we were left with the familiar feeling equal parts exhaustion, satisfaction and accomplishment. The fishing had been spectacular, the scenery breathtaking and the experience shared with mates unforgettable. Reflecting on the day over a beer, one thing stood out. No matter the pattern, no matter the conditions, the best dry fly is the one you favour and enjoy fishing the most. <laughs> I wasn't ready for the shape. Did you didn't even come out. <laughs> no.